Hey, welcome back. If watching your waistline is part of your New Year's resolution, then dining out can be a tricky thing to do. So here to share some secrets on how to maintain healthy eating habits at a restaurant is manager of Fogo de Chon, Bernard Landicho. Thanks for waking up early with us this morning. morning. So I want to tell people about the concept of your restaurant. It's a little bit different. It is. It's a traditional churrascaria or Brazilian steakhouse where, you know, the gaucho chef or southern Brazilian cowboy chef serves you table side after you serve yourself in the market table with some of our gourmet salads and fruits. I cannot tell you how many people I've heard amazing things yes. about your restaurant thank from. You, so you. the response has been incredible, huh? It's been incredible. We've been busy. Uh, January is here. Uh, we're very excited to start a new year. And the food is so good. It's a place that you might overeat. So yes. what are the tricks to kind of keeping your waistline trim, but right. still, you know, having your indulgement of good foods? I mean, you could all also do this trick in, the, in your house anywhere, really. It's all about the moderation, uh, pr uh, proper proportions of the Always, food that you right? have. And you have you want to have your plate as colorful as possible. Like today, I have this pineapple here, rich in antioxidants. Oh, yeah. Some salmon, which is rich in omega three, good for the heart. Some pomegranate, Always you know, good. that helps you. For and then these, you told me. These are called palmitos or hearts of palms. So good. Yeah, it's really great. They're it's great in fiber, right? Yes, it's great in any kind of salad. Yes, and right. I love this. You said this is a lentil couscous. Lentil, lentil quinoa. Quinoa. Yeah. yeah. You, you can also use couscous if you like couscous. That's uh, it's always really good if mm -hmm. you're trying to eat healthy. And we're actually going to make a salad together, That huh? is correct. What uh, are we making? We are making the orange kale salad. It's very right. simple. So we have our honey and uh, orange elixir here. Which is fantastic. You want. Yeah, some people. I'm going to put yeah. some on here? Yeah, of course. I always am known for putting too much dressing on my salad. So. <laughs> is that good? Yes, that's right. So just and nice and toss it just a little bit like that. Okay, if you want some um, onions, you can top it off of onions. Of course. More than welcome to. Some orange for there. I love it. Yes. And this is, you know, going to what you were saying about it being so colorful, right? right. So we want to kind of have that balance of some fruits, some vegetables, and yeah. some, some on onions is really good for you. So if you like anything spice or any something citrusy, this is really good. Good breakfast And what salad. is in this dressing? Because it is fantastic. Yeah, it's honey. It's a little bit of red vinaigrette. Okay. Uh, any kind of vinaigrette, really. Some Dijon mustard and honey. Really simple. Simple. It doesn't have a lot yes. of like the long ingredients we see on right. things we you get You just want to complement the flavors you of the natural You can make that. So you're going to put chicken in some? Uh, yeah, if you want one? to. Yeah, uh, it's up to you. Um, really, you can have uh, without with, proteins. Or without? Or with, without proteins. Our chicken, very simple. Lemon, pepper, and that's it. And how do you cook it? Usually, you can do it in an oven or fire roasted uh, grill, whatsoever. Very simple. And what's in that mix? It's just a lemon pepper, or you can find this in your local market. Try to choose the ones with the lowest sodium. And that's what you guys are known for, all of these flavors, right? Exactly. We You're going to get a little something of everything when you right. go. That's right. We just want to complement every single thing. And I want to head over here because this is some of my yes, favorite stuff. Yes, this is my favorite as well. <laughs> Cheese and cured meats is really, really good for you. Uh, cured meats are high in fiber and, these peppers. Uh, and some bell peppers, so high good. in vitamin C. Tell so. everybody where you're located. We're located at 301 West Big Beaver, just right in front of the Marriott uh, off of 75. Uh, Come visit us. We'd love yes. it. Thanks so Thank much for so joining much. us. Thanks You're for cooking for us. We'll be right back with the news brief after the break.